Let's put up the graphic of John Morant and Derrick Rose. Both are in their third year. Both are 22 years old. And John Morant, as we're all talking about Embiid and we're talking about Jokic and Giannis, not getting as much MVP buzz as he has the Grizzlies right now, second in the West in a year that I don't think many people were expecting. And Wade, Rose wasn't the only third-year guy that was 22 years old that also came into his own. And I think as we come down the stretch here, what are you hoping for for Mr. John Morant? Well, I think the, the, the biggest thing is, is just like Shaq in my third year, he presented a challenge to me. And that challenge was to go do something that no one else in your age group is doing. You know, go, go become an NBA champion. And so, you know, we have this space where we have this young talent. We have Luca, we have Ja, we have these young guys who are great. Don't wait. I don't want to see Ja wait. I think, you know, if you look at the Memphis Grizzlies, and, and I will give Candace a lot of credit because Candace has been on this train before a lot of us jumped on it, but they were 11 and 2 without Ja Morant. Mm. And so when you think about that, you think about the team that was put together. You know, obviously, you know, that team is, it gets the highlights from what Ja does, but it's a very good defensive team as well. You know, you've, angry, had, you've yeah. had your eye on Ja for a while. You invited him on stage, and you came to us a few weeks ago and said, I feel like me and Ja have similar moves. Well, we got something we want to show you. This is you and Ja, and I, I want you to talk through this, man. Like, how much of yourself do you see in him? Well, I, I think the cool thing for a guy like Ja Moran is he got opportunity to watch Allen Iverson and Derrick Rose and, and someone like myself. These smaller guards Capture. who play a lot bigger than they are, right? And so... I look at Ja, I look at it similar to me. We're not known for our outside shot, but lead the league in paint points, right? Putting the pressure on the rim at all times. We'll put a body on, on you at any moment going to the basket and just using his athleticism in so many amazing ways. So I see a lot of similarities in my game as well to Ja, um, but I think he just he mixed a lot of us together and he's taking it to even another level. And the regular earthlings don't understand this. The difference between good and great is the great players know they're great. Like when I went to D-Wade, I was like, you're a great player. He's like, huh? I'm like, bro, you're a great player. I wouldn't be here unless you're a great player. And once you know that, and once you get that attitude and start playing like that, like this kid, he knows he's a great player. It yes. ain't nothing. You can criticize him. You can say what did. You can say he's shooting too much. It don't matter. He knows he's a great player. He was player. calling himself a point god yes. in college. Yes. <laughs> you know what? I'll say this. You talk about just similar games, but similar, like, rise. I mean, you dominated in the NCAA tournament yep. at Marquette, similar to what Ja did. Mm -hmm. You weren't ranked number one from the time you came up. So I think it's that, like, mentality, mm. that grind, that, like, you weren't always told you were the best, that you had to work. And that's what Ja did coming into this year. He mm. worked, and it, it, it shows on the court. Like, you should have seen his little cute face and I said, yo, man, you're the best player in the league. He was like, huh? <laughs> like, I, I'm not playing with your brother. You're the best, mm. for real. I promise you the best. And like, he... He kind of believed it, but he didn't really be. But once I validated that, yeah. then then he just, you know, he would listen. He was already going that way anywhere, sure. but I just, I just had to, light yeah, just light. just light it. But you know, listen, Jaws good. You know, Penny was like that. Kobe was like that. Yeah. This kid, it will definitely be his league in the next few years.